Africa Rice Recipes Chebu Gen Senegal's Rice and Fish Dish A number of rice dishes are prepared in Senegal, a country situated in West Africa. But the most popular rice dish is Chebu Gen, a richly flavored combination of fresh fish, rice and vegetables. The name of the dish is derived from Cheb, which in local Wolof language means rice, and Gen which means fish. Mrs. Maria Madi Yang, from Senegal, who works at the Africa Rice Center, Africa Rice, will show you how Chebu Gen is prepared. This dish requires about 30 to 40 minutes of preparation time and about one and a half hours of cooking time. To prepare Chebu Gen for four persons, you will need the following ingredients. One large, about 2 kilograms, fish, preferably a grouper or any other white fish, rinsed and cut into four large chunks. 250 grams of tomato concentrate. Half liter of peanut or vegetable oil. One kilogram of rice. Senegalese prefer to use broken rice for this recipe, but you can use normal rice. 100 grams of dried fish such as stock fish rinsed. 200 grams of carrots peeled. 200 grams of cassava peeled. One small cabbage chopped into four pieces. Four okra, optional. Four sweet potatoes peeled. Two eggplants with the stems removed and cut into. Four small turnips peeled. One onion. One clove garlic. Three green chili peppers. One bunch fresh parsley. One small green bell pepper. One jumbo cube, if you are unable to find it, you could substitute a fish or shrimp flavored maggi cube, salt to taste. One tablespoon black pepper. Preparation. Deseed and cut in half the bell pepper. Slice the onion and chop finely the parsley. Peel the garlic clove and cut into two pieces. Make a paste by grinding together the parsley, half of the bell pepper, half tablespoon of the black pepper, and half of the garlic clove with a mortar and pestle, or in a grinder. Add a pinch of salt. Using a knife, make a slit in each chunk of fish, but be careful not to make the cut all the way through. Stuff the slits with this paste. Heat 2 to 3 inches of oil in a large pan, and fry the fish pieces for about 3 to 4 minutes, on both sides. Remove the fish and set aside. In the same pan, fry half of the sliced onion, the remaining half of the bell pepper, and one chili pepper. Add the tomato concentrate. Dilute with a little water. Let it simmer for two to three minutes. Pour one liter of water, and add salt. Bring the mixture to a boil for five minutes. Then add all the vegetables. The wash dried fish along with the remaining chili peppers. Cover and simmer on low heat for 30 minutes. Grind together the remaining black pepper, garlic, onion, bell pepper with the jumbo cube. Pour this paste into the pan and add the fried fish. Reduce the heat and let the mixture simmer another 15 minutes. Remove the fish pieces and all the vegetables with a little sauce. Leave the rest of the sauce in the pan. Wash the rice and half cook it. Preferably using a steamer. Remove the half-cooked rice from the steamer, and stir it in the pan with the remaining sauce. Cook it for 15 minutes. Watch, and stir every 5 minutes. 
spoon the cooked rice in a large serving platter. Arrange the fish and vegetables over the rice and garnish with lemon wedges. Bon appétit à tout le monde. According to Dr. Jane Morera, a Senegalese national, this is how an authentic cheddar gen is cooked. Alors, le a wide variety of vegetables and fish can be used, making cheddar gen a versatile and healthy dish. Disclosing the secret behind the Senegalese preference for broken rice and preparing cheddar gen, rather than long grain rice, he explains that the broken rice seems to better absorb the sauce, and is more pleasing to the taste. The, the cheddar gen is excellent. Very good. <laughs> Really, really, I like it. Mm.